Thanks for joining us for today's edition of Our Daily Bread. Our reading titled, Rainy Days, was written by Cindy Hess Casper. When small businesses in Tennessee were abruptly shuttered in an attempt to stop the spread of COVID-19, shop owners worried about how to care for their employees, how to pay their rent, and how to simply survive the crisis. In response to their concerns, the pastor of a church near Nashville started an initiative to supply cash to struggling business owners. We don't feel like we can sit on a rainy day fund when somebody else is going through a rainy day, the pastor explained, as he encouraged other churches in the area to join the effort. A rainy day fund is money that's put aside in case normal income is decreased for a time while regular operations need to continue. While it's natural for us to look out for ourselves first, Scripture encourages us to always look beyond our own needs to find ways to serve others and to practice generosity. Proverbs 11 reminds us, One person gives freely, yet gains even more. A generous person will prosper, and whoever refreshes others will be refreshed. Is the sun shining extra bright in your life today? Look around to see if there's torrential rain in someone else's world. The blessings God has graciously given you are multiplied when you freely share them with others. Being generous and open-handed is a wonderful way to give hope to others and to remind hurting people that God loves them. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from Proverbs 11, verses 23 through 26. The desire of the righteous ends only in good, but the hope of the wicked only in wrath. One person gives freely, yet gains even more. Another withholds unduly, but comes to poverty. A generous person will prosper. Whoever refreshes others will be refreshed. People curse the one who hoards grain, but they pray God's blessing on the one who is willing to sell. Let's pray together. Our gracious God, we thank you for providing for our needs and giving us the means to care for each other. Help us to be sensitive to the needs of others and show us how we can share your love and generosity with them. Give us opportunities to give freely to others who are in need. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thanks for listening. I'm Rochelle Traub, and today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.